Hello guys, welcome to Solving Solutions to the Balance Channel where I get solutions to all your solving problems. It's nice having your class again today, how have you been? On today's tutorial, we are going to show you how to create vertices on this line, right? Good now. That will now create some points on this line whose coordinates we are also going to determine, right? Good. So let's search for future vertices to point, right? Good. So good. So we open it up. Now for the feature vertices to point, it creates a feature class containing points generated from specified vertices or location of the point features, right? Good. Now our input feature will be the line we have here. Good. Then the output feature class, we are going to navigate to the folder we want to save it. So we call it vertices, right? Now, the point type, there are different ways to specify the output points. We have the all, mid, start, end, both ends, and then the diagonal, the right? Now, so when you read this description, you are going to see which of the vertices you want to create along your line or maybe in your polygon or whatever vector data you have there. So on today's tutorial, we are going to use all. You can use the drop down to select the other options, right? Good. So let's use all. So having um, imputed all of these parameters, we can just click on OK. Now our tool has been executed successfully, right? Good. So you can see the points. There's a new point layer. And then these are the vertices, right? Good. So if we open it up, like if we open up the attributes table rather, we are going to see what different fields, right? Good. Now, remember what we told you we wanted to do was that we also wanted to get, good, we also wanted to get the coordinates of this point, right? Good. So having those points are not enough for us. We also want to get their coordinates. So let's come to this um, vertices layer. Then we open up our attributes table, which is here already anyway. Then we now try to add a new field. So we add a field. We call this field the latitude. Then the type, we are going to use double. Then our precision, let's say 20. Then our scale, let's also make it 20. Now, the precision refers to the total number of significant values that we can have to describe what the latitude or the longitude, right? But then the scale defines the number of digits we are going to have them on the right hand side of what the decimal right good. So let's leave them at 2020 so that we can have them um, quite um, a good description for our latitude and our longitude. So we click on OK. That has been added. We also create another one for the longitude, right? Then we click on OK. Now, the next thing is for us to populate what these new fields that we have created. So to do that, we right click on the, on the field and then we come to calculate geometry. We are about to calculate outside of the earth. Now, our latitude is what? The y coordinate, right? So we leave it as um, the y coordinate of a point or of the point. Then the, Coordinate system we are using is um, WGS84. The unit is what um, decimal degrees. We click on OK. Yeah. Similarly, we come down to the longitude. We calculate geometry. Yes. Then that's for what the X coordinate of points. We click on OK. Good. So, so far, we have been able to what create the vertices or use the feature vertices to point by creating some points along what our polygon, let's say, the line we have here. We have also identified their coordinates, right, good, as they are. So you can decide to copy them from here to maybe Excel or maybe any other location you want to work with it or maybe just um, export the the data that um, we have actually created alongside the latitude and longitude, right? So what a different location you want. 
So thanks for coming to class. We hope we have shown you how to create what vertices along the line by getting their points and also getting what um, by creating the points and also getting the coordinates of those points that um, have been created. So we are going to see you on the next video. Ensure you keep staying safe and have a very good time. Bye.